guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we are doing a finale of a project pan. I'm not feeling very prepared for this video. <laughs> So if you guys have been following it, I did uh, start a project pan back in July actually um, and it's a group of project panners here. Um, we all kind of like joined together to do this finish 13 by Halloween and uh, today is Halloween. I'm actually, actually today is the day before Halloween that I'm filming this but you're going to see this on Halloween and um, yeah, I don't have a lot to report. This is probably the worst I've ever done on a project pan ever. So as you guys know, this last year has been crazy for me, but specifically the last few months with all of the trips out of town and then the moving and everything, it's been a little nuts. And uh, I feel like I usually am pretty good at panning products, but um, I didn't do so good this time. So let's jump on in. So as I mentioned, there are 13 products. I want to start with two products that I currently don't have with me. Uh, one of them is from Clarins. It's the Clarins Body Fit. It is like a toning body lotion. Um, that one is packed up because we are staying temporarily with family. A lot of the, um, a lot of my stuff is still in storage. So I was hoping to be kind of settled a little bit more by now, but we really just aren't. So that item I don't have access to, and it's definitely not gone. I've barely used it since I started this project. I maybe only used it a handful of times during this project. So um, I did want to start there because I don't have that. And then, and then the second item that I don't have with me is a makeup facial primer, a facial primer, uh, and it is from the brand Makeup Forever. It is like a deluxe sample size of the smoothing primer. That also got misplaced during the move. I think it might have accidentally got packed up. Um, I, I, sh I should have had all of my makeup, but I feel like I'm missing a few things. So I think that accidentally got put in the wrong box and is in storage currently because I cannot find that either. <laughs> So yeah, that we're off to a great start so far, but let's get into the other 11 products that I actually do have here and I will show you what I've been able to use up and what I haven't. So next up, I'll show you uh, some things I finished off. So I did actually, technically I didn't finish it, but it's done now. This is the brow pencil from It Cosmetics. Um, the reason I didn't technically finish it is because it like, broke. It like dried up and the whole thing fell out of it and there's like chunky pieces on here but I'm not sure why that happened with this pencil. Um, I did receive this one in a boxy charm, I believe so um, I don't know if it was just old or something but I hadn't been using it very long and the whole thing like dried out and fell out and it was like all crumbled and stuff so yeah I did technically I wasn't able to finish this one but we are going to call that one garbage now. And then the other product I actually was able to finish off, I kind of forced myself to finish this. Um, this is from Urban Decay. It is the All Nighter Foundation. I have the shade 3.0 here. I do also own the shade 2.0, which I actually like the shade match a lot better. This particular foundation, it just oxidized on me really bad. So, I mean, it does oxidize. That's just part of the formula. But um, for this shade, when it after it oxidized, it looked way too orange and dark on my skin. So the 2.0 works better. Um, but yeah, this matched me fine when I applied it after it would oxidize it was way too dark so I was really happy that I was actually able to finish this off I tried really hard to get it done before the summer months ended because then it worked a little bit better when I had more of a tan so so those two products actually finished the rest of these not finished so there is a couple products that I was so dang close on I almost thought about just saying I'm done with it but technically I'm not one of them is this Monate um, thickening spray there is maybe one or two uses left in here like it is almost gone um, I it, it you can't see into this bottle but I can feel that it's almost empty there's just a tiny bit of liquid left on the bottom so one or two more uses and this will be done you guys will definitely see this in my next empties video because it is that close I was so dang close on this but I didn't quite make it so yeah, uh, same thing with this facial spray from Gerard Cosmetics. This one, I was so close and you will be able to see, uh, there's just the tiniest bit of liquid left on the bottom here. I, 
I almost was like, ah, oh, just spray it and get it done with, but I don't know. I probably have maybe four uses left on this guy. Like, it is almost gone. I feel like I did really well on both of these. I just needed probably another week, and I would have been good on both. And then another product that was just like, oh, so close, but didn't quite make it is this Maybelline Fit Me Powder. This, again, like, I just thought, like, I'm for sure going to do this, and I didn't quite make it. So hopefully you guys can see it's super dark in here. Like I, even with all my bright lights, it's dark in here. Uh, it's it's now fall in Seattle, so this is how it's going to be for a while. But um, yeah, so as you can see, there's just the slightest uh, bit of uh, powder on the rim here. I've been using that to set my eyelid with an eye brush because that's the only way I can get into that powder now. So I've slowed down on using it. Since I'm not using it for my full face anymore, the process of using it has slowed down a little bit. But I know, again, one more week and I'll probably have this gone, but it just quite it didn't quite make it. So... All right, another item that I was so close on. This is the Patchology um, Flash Patch Eye Gels. So there are 30 eye gels in here, or at least it says there's 30. I feel like there's more because this has just been going forever. Um, I can't really count, but it looks like there's probably, ugh, I don't know, maybe another 15. I swear, I've been using this like crazy. I'm I, I'm so surprised how much there is in here. It says 30 pairs, but I feel like there's more because I've just been using this nonstop and there's still quite a lot in here. So didn't quite make it on these, but I definitely have been using them a lot, at least once a week, if not more. And uh, I think they're really nice. I really do enjoy them, but it's just taking me so long to go through this little thing. All right, next I wanna show you the progress on this lipstick here. This is the Charlotte Tilbury Bitch Perfect. I knew when I pulled this into this project that I probably wouldn't finish this, but I was gonna see how good I could do. And I have been wearing this a ton. So I will insert a picture of where I started with this product, and then I'll show you where I'm at now so hopefully there'll be a bit a big difference in uh, where I started to where I am now because I have been using this non-stop I've been carrying it around in my bag and wearing it and like reapplying it throughout the day so I feel like I've used it a lot and hopefully that you'll be able to see that the worst I've ever done on a project ever before <laughs> okay next another uh, product that's just not done and this is the bite um, beauty lip pencil I honestly just was not using this regularly. I just, I don't know, I just never reached for it. It's a nice color. It pairs well with that lipstick I just showed you. Um, sometimes I would use this to like fill my lips in completely as well. I think it's a nice pencil, it's a nice color. I just didn't reach for it. I've just been so busy and honestly, like this project like was the last thing on my mind the last few months, so I did not do as good as I usually do. All right, and then next I have the uh, Pure Cosmetics. This is a lip um, scrubby pencil type product. Um, I just, yeah, I didn't even come close on this guy. There's still a lot. I'm going to roll it up. That's how much is left. There's a lot still there on. I, I don't know. I don't like this a whole lot, so I wasn't reaching for it frequently. And I don't, I'd only kind of pull it out when I was like, Ooh, I need to use my project products. Then I would pull it out. So I wasn't using it consistently. And I don't know if I'm going to even continue to try to use it because I just don't like it. All right. And then next we have a single eyeshadow from Becca. This is in the shade Venus. It's a beautiful color. I love this eyeshadow, but I probably only used it a handful of times during the whole project. I, again, I've just, I know it's gonna get old hearing me say it, but I really just did not uh, focus on this product project the way that I normally do with projects, so um, I just didn't have that much progress. Okay, and then the final item to update you guys on is this NARS Eyelid Primer. This is impossible to show you what's left. I know that I'm at the point where when I stick it in, it's hard to get any out, but I am still getting enough out. So it's not done, but I have a feeling, again, that this is one that's gonna be empty within the next week or two because it is pretty darn close. So that is my finale on this Finish 13 by Halloween project. I think that is the worst I've ever done. I'm definitely going to title this fail or something. It's probably the worst I've ever done in a project before. I think I learned my lesson. Like I already had my 2018 project going and I just had so much going on. I probably should not have even attempted to do this, but I was really grateful for Shay uh, from Lipsticks Lipstick Lashes and Wine uh, is her channel name for inviting me, and um, I, I did I did make some progress, so I still feel good that I was able to use up a couple things and make some progress on a couple other things. So um, I will make sure to link all the other channels uh, down below that were involved in this 
uh, project. I'm a little late on posting my finale as well. I just feel like <laughs> I missed the last update and then I was late posting the finale. Like it, this project has been a little challenging for me. So definitely going to take a break before I start any new projects other than my uh, 18 and 2018 that I am continuing to work on. Um, I just feel like I have too much going on right now to try to add more to my plate. So I hope you guys enjoyed this finale. Wish me luck on finishing up these products. Uh, I, I definitely will have a few of these done before my next empties video. So look out for that and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Thank you.